Diamonds fall into my covers Where they sink one by one Yeah, I watch them disappear to nothing Disposable as chewing gum Actually, for the highlighter right now, I have the Mo Honey and Afternoon Snack on my face right now, so yeah. Hey Gem, I hope you're doing well today. Okay, so you know that Fenty Beauty just launched a whole line of really, really colorful lipsticks. So we're going to take a look at the Popsicle. No, Popsicle. No, no not Popsicle. Okay, so we're going to take a look at the Peltsicle Juicy Satin Lipsticks, okay? And they come, it says, Bold Luscious Color Juicy Satin Finish, which we're going to take a look at today. So yeah, this is not one of the fancy ones, by the way. So I'm going to go ahead and wipe my lips down, and we're just going to go through swatches, okay? We just want to see what all these lipsticks are about, okay? So if you want to see the Peltsicle Juicy Satin Lipsticks from Fenty swatched on me, then keep on watching. You know, my lips are bare. We're just going to take us through these, these swatches, and we're going to see what these are all about. I'm so excited. I love colorful lips. I'm going to start off with Alpha Doll, and Alpha Doll is this beautiful purple pinkish shade and this is what that looks like So for this one, you definitely need a lip liner if you're someone who's as dark as me and you want to make it work, you know. I'm going to go ahead and line my lips with a dark brown lip pencil. And this is the pitch from Colourpop. So if I were if I were wearing this, this is as this is the extent my liner is gonna go because I don't want the liner to overtake the color. I still wanted to show, so this is like how much I'm gonna line it. Like this is it. It's very creamy. Feels very nice on the lips. It feels very nice on the lips, so it's not like really super. It's very opaque too. I like it. it feels very nice. So this is the shade Tropic Tantrum. is a deeper pink compared to the more lavender pink that I tried earlier and I love it. Colorful lips, I love them. Of course, you're gonna have to line this once again with some brown lip, should I? So once again, I am lining it with a deep brown pencil. You also have the option to line it with a red pencil or a deeper purple pencil, okay? I said a deeper red pencil, but I didn't find exactly a red pencil. This is more like an orangey burnt red pencil so i'm gonna use that because i feel like this shade gives it like a little bit more of like a little bit like it's not too dark to line it with but it's not too bright like it doesn't really match the actual lip so i like how it looks right now when i use a light highlighter it makes me look wet i, I like it but a lot of people will say uh it looks like you're no so this is what it would look like if you didn't line it with a brown or dark brown lip liner and you did like a little bit of a reddish lip liner i like the look
is like a bellhop. Yeah, I love a cry for help. But I'm tired of I'm gonna go over it with a dark brown pencil so you can see how that would also look. I like this combo. These are so creamy. It's making my it makes my lips feel very moisturized. I really like this lip combo. Okay guys, so I wiped it off, but my lips are a little stained, so I feel like this is nothing a little bit of cleansing oil or coconut oil can't take off. I'm using the DHC cleansing oil. I'm just gonna put a little bit onto my wipe and see if that takes it off. So if nothing at all, these shades are pigmented. Look at my lips. Look at my lips. Look at my lips. Okay, I'm taking this shade Perpsicle and I'm going to I'm going to put it on my lips. I don't think I'm gonna line my lips anymore because I mean you guys get the idea. You can use um, a shade that's the same shade but deeper, or you can use a dark brown pencil, or you can use another color to try to create like an ombre look. You know, you you know. Say what you want, but you can't call these shades not opaque because it covered over this red thing that I got going on really nicely. I'm just applying a little bit more highlighter. <sighs> this is gorgeous. I feel like I can wear this by itself just like that. All I know is my lips are already red and I'm going to try the red lip next. So at the end of all this, I'm just going to have to do a little lip soak and like some oil or something to get rid of the... These things are pigmented. Like... Now my lips look like lip stain. Oh, anyway, so I'm gonna try the shade Hot Blooded next. It's a very beautiful, beautiful, beautiful shade. It looks almost orange on the monitor, but it's very, very red. I love red lips. It's so cute. It's so cute. A little highlighter. Just a... I'm using Mo Honey. I really love how Mo Honey looks on me. Okay, so with this one, of course, you can go ahead and line it if you want, or you can just leave it the way it is. Now, personally, if I was going to line this, hmm, I wouldn't line it. Like, personally, I wouldn't line it. If you want to line it, you could once again go in with the darker brown pencil, so it gives it like a slight ombre, or you can go in with like a deep red pencil to just give it like a little bit of an outline, but personally, it looks very good just the way it is. Okay, my lips are progressively getting redder. Like, like at this point, I could just line my lips and go. We have this shade next. It's a beautiful, beautiful orange shade, and I think I'm in love with this one. I'm fairly sure I'm in love with this shade. This is the This is the shade Sun Snatched. 
sun snatched say that five times fast right i feel like it could almost be like a neon orange shade let's find out i hope i can cover this red i have on my lips i'm just glad these shades are as opaque as the um the matte lips or the stunner lip paints because if not then it wouldn't be shining through this red i have on my lips that's like stained Okay guys, so this is it. I feel like I can see the red shining through just a little bit. Like it looks more purplish now. But I feel like without me swatching all the other lips that this would be very, very much a neon, almost neon orange look. I really love this. Like orange lips are the rage. I love it. And honestly, I don't feel like lining this one either. <laughs> I don't feel like lining it. Okay, so this shade is Moto Moto Boat Moto Boat <laughs> Moto Boat Moto Boat Moto Boat. I I don't know how to say. This is a Moto Boat. And this is like a baby blue paint, baby blue shade. So pretty. Mm -hmm. uh, you guys, I feel like because my lips are stained, it's not doing this justice. I put cleansing oil on my lips just to let it soak in a little bit. Pick off as much of the color as I possibly can because I want this blue to shine. Okay, you guys, let's go ahead and try this again better. It's so juicy. I, I feel like this is the kind of lip like this I feel like this is the kind of lip that you don't tame like what are you gonna do with it you know okay guys so this is the last one this is the shade go deep I'm gonna swatch it You guys, I love this blue. I love go deep. Go deep is it. Okay, you guys, so that's it for my swatches of the new Fenty Beauty Poutsicle Juicy Satin Lips. I will say that these shades are very, very pigmented. They're so creamy. It's borderline glossy. It feels very nice on my lips. It feels like it's actually moisturizing my lips. I love it. The color payoff is amazing, and I feel like if my lips wasn't, wasn't stained from the previous red shades, that the blue shades would have shown out. Well, the blue and the orange shade would have showed out really 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 intense on me but because my lips were like stained before i got to them i feel like it's not showing its truest colors but even this color payoff is 
still amazing. Don't get me wrong. This color payoff is amazing. Because my lips are stained, it's not as intense as I think it would be. So if you're someone who's just not going to be swatching all the lips and you're just picking up a few of the shades to try out, just know that they're very, very intense. They're very, very opaque. Very pigmented. So juicy and so almost glossy. Like this close to being glossy. Like it's very, very cute. I like Fenty lip products. I, they know how to do lip products. It's just, it's, it, it just is what it is. It is what it is, yo. Okay, guys. So, okay, Jim. So that's it for my. Okay, so that's it for my swatches. I really hope you enjoyed it. Let me know down below in the comments which one of the shades I tried is your favorite. Let me know how you're gonna wear it. Let me know what line you're gonna pair it up with. Because after a while, the shades were just so pretty. I'm like, I could just wear this by itself, you know? But if you feel like you, you can't wear it by itself, let me know down below in the comments what shade liner you would use on each of the ones that I swatched. And also just let me know which one is your favorite and let me know which one you're gonna pick up. Yeah, but if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, I mean, if you watched all this way and you haven't yet subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Also, just remember to share this video with your friends so they can come back and watch it. I'm reminding you, you don't have to do it if you don't want to, but hopefully you watch this far because you like it and you will subscribe it. And also just remember to give it a big thumbs up, okay? See ya. Bye.